top 25. All right, top 25, South Jersey's number one, obviously. Uh, Miami at two. Uh, LSU at three. UCLA at four. Iowa State at five. Penn State at six. North Carolina at seven. Florida at eight. Texas Tech at nine. Arkansas at 10. Houston at 11. Michigan at 12. Ah, ha, ha. Uh, Arizona at 13. Wisconsin at 14. Stanford at 15. Bama at 16. Duke at 17. Syracuse at 18. Texas A&M at 19. Tennessee at 20. Clemson at 21. Michigan State at 22. Arizona State at 23. And Oklahoma State at 24. And then Oklahoma at 25. I'm Brad Nessler, here along with two of the best commentators in the game, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. It's the most miserable weather you could have for a football game. Cold and rainy for the Rams and the Indiana Hoosiers. It's midseason here in the Big Ten, and these two teams know each other very well. And here come the Hoosiers. The Rams come out like they're just going to roll over this team. What do you think about that, Herbie? The away team has a big-time quarterback who can really put up some big numbers against his defense. I look for him to have an outstanding game spreading the ball to his receivers. Lee, look for a big blowout here. Nice pick, Kirk. I really believe that these guys are going to do it. They're changing the play. They'll throw on first down. Throwing a raw, raw impact player. Oh my God, we're in there, bitch. Yeah, we different. They went for the home run and the wideout came through with a big time play. Great call. Fucking insane. They'll throw on first down. Give me that. It's just to the point now where shit teams can't. This is what I like though. Since we did the change of the sliders, shit teams play like shit, and tough teams play play like oh fuck, we're in a dog fight. So. Defense has been a reason why they're number one right now. Oh my God, in the bucket. It's getting insane. Oh, come on, Scoob. This is you, big dog. There he is, Scooby Jackson. This has been one of our best seasons as picking the ball off. Like, we're actually, we're, we're getting to the football. Scooby out here, a straight savage this year, man. The blocking. This is what I, I, I believe in our, our run game is because due to our receivers having great blocking, you know? And it's been phenomenal. Our, our, our receivers have more pancakes than our linemen do this, this year. It's insane. In and, and Charles and I had a boy Ellis. I was unfortunate enough to uh that's another one too with injuries, but he played Indiana. Holy shit, Ellis. Stop, <laughs> dude. That's what I'm talking about. I feel bad because last couple games Ty Bryson hasn't got any touches, and I'm putting shit in the bucket for him today. Splitting. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's Rex Brown, dude. And the DBs in the lineup. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Rifles this one out to the left. He's going deep. Oh, my God. Come on. Play action. Look. He's looking for K-Dot. Please, K-Dot. Oh, my God. K-Dot got a pick. What is going on here, guys? Ladies and gentlemen, K-Dot with the pick. Unbelievable work we're having this 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 time he's actually he actually caught a pick not getting burnt for the final time they'll throw on first down rolling out to the right side going for the home run got a man thank the lord oh my lord no rah rah oh shit oh shit this ain't good oh this ain't good dude And just like that, we get it hurt and we throw him picks. Uh oh. Out for the game, strain tricep. All right. At least it ain't. That a boy, 55. Welcome, man. Look at that, man. Second the team with tackle for loss with 13. Yikes, man. 
That man like work at AutoZone. He's like, yeah, I go play for the for the for America. Oh, you be back by break. <laughs> Read you on this card, bro. Well, there you have it. SJU comes to Indiana, beats them badly. 30, 30 to skunk. Stinky in here. Yo. That's right. Uh, game stats, total offense, we had 386 yards compared to their 140. Yeah, we just dominated. It was, it's what it is. Uh, South Jersey, Castro, 12 out of 22. Uh, 350 yards, three touchdowns, one pick, and one sack. That's a good day for the kid. Uh, oops. Rushing, uh, we didn't run the ball. What is that when we have Castro as a Heisman candidate? Sorry, my uh, Michael. It is what it is. But today was just we throwing the football today. Ra Ra Jackson before we got hurt. Six catches, one seventy, two touchdowns. Ty three catches, ninety with one tutty. Uh, Martin, Drew, and Wilson and Johnny had a catch. Sorry about iconic, but I think he dropped it past it. Yeah, so tough for the kid, but it's all good though. Uh, blocking pancakes. I hop. Who wants who wants maple syrup on their pancakes? This guy does. Seven pancakes for the day. Uh, Kylo with uh, six tackles, tackle for loss for three. Justin Smith with a pick. Uh, Jalen Ellis with a tackle for loss. He was in there in the backfield as well as a safety. He was a dog. Kenny Problems, four tackles, three uh, tackles for loss. Not ideal, of, you know, from a – he was already a Heisman candidate, but we got to lock in for him as well. But he's – he'll be there. Trust me. Big trust. Uh, Jerry Brickhouse, three tackles uh, with a pick. Uh, K-Dot with a pick. Jordan Ellis had two sacks for the game. Kid was going crazy. Uh, Scooby Jackson with a pick. Who else? We get one. Anyone else? Uh, Rex Brown and then Cyrus with a sack too as well. So we were up just defense out of the ball dominating. That's what we need to keep doing throughout the season. But there you have it. Rams beat Indiana 30 to nothing. Playoff rankings. They got us at number one, which I like. LSU at two. UCLA at three. Ohio State at four. Penn at five. North Carolina at six. Okay, Texas Tech at seven. All right, not too shabby there. Uh, South Jersey, we're on a bye, be, but uh, they beat Bama fifty to twenty. Ew. Ew. Nah. That's that's disgusting, dude. UCLA uh, three, Penn, Penn at four, Ohio State at five, North Carolina at six. Florida at 7, Miami at 8, Texas Tech at 9, Houston at 10, Wisconsin at 11, 12 at Syracuse, 13 Texas A&M, 14 Stanford, they lost UCLA, ew, uh, Arizona at 15, Michigan at 16, Arkansas at 17, Duke at 18, Georgia at 19, Bama at 20, Bama, uh, Auburn at 21, Florida State at 22, Colorado at 23, Clemson at 24, Baylor at 25. Well, Castro's still there, uh, but the move is, is you know, mutual right now. So hopefully we play uh, Iowa, we'll lock in because Isaac Austin is moving up. He's got 37 touchdowns, so we got to... We gotta throw the rock a little bit. We gotta throw a little bit of the pill. Cause he's he's kinda creeping up, but it doesn't help that this man ain't with on Bama as well. So But we'll lock in, we'll get ready to go. We're gonna pump we're gonna do the uh Miami South Beach jersey too, because I wanna see how they look. Eight and oh right now. Uh six and in the conference would be like. Uh Wisconsin is four and one. How is that? Ohio State four and one, Penn at four and one, Michigan and Michigan State three and two, as well as Nebraska, uh, Northwest Illinois is two and three, Purdue is just a sh they are a shit show this season. Goodness gracious, one and four is Maryland and three and three and five Indiana three and six is one and five. Minnesota hasn't even sniffed a div conference game. Yikes. I'm Brad Nessler, here along with two of the best commentators in the game, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. The players will have to battle cold temperatures in the game tonight between the Iowa Hawkeyes and the Rams. We've had some great games so far this season, and this one has all the makings to be another fantastic one. And here come the Rams. 
The Rams are much too powerful to be stopped in this game. Kirk, what are your thoughts? The home team comes into this football game led by their quarterback, and he's such a leader, Brad. Believe me, he won't buy into any of this pregame, we're going to blow him out hoopla. He's a focused competitor, and he'll be ready to play. Nice pick, Kirk. I really believe that these guys are going to do it. In the zone right now and looking to take away half the field. Castro set to go to the air. He's looking. Oh, my Lord. What a dot. Welcome back, Ricky Moss. Holy shit. What a snag. We had a nice little uh, of the 2000s remembering NFL players. There it is. That a boy, Justin Smith. Another. You gotta stop, man. You gotta stop. I'm right here. That's a. Oh, you dropped it. That's what I'm saying, man. That's gotta be a tutty. Oh, you, we're dropping the football, man. Oh my God. We're like, what are we doing? Oh! Oh my God! Okay, let's go! Look at him, man! What a pick from Ellis! Look at the kid! Got a boy, Kylo! That's gotta be Tuddy. Jesus! With a face mask. Oh, look at Castro. That's my dog right there. He said, excuse me. Iconic. Oh, my God. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh shit, that's what is that? Come on. Yo, Rex, what are we just don't want the football? What are we doing? Look at that one. No. What the hell? I ain't wearing that shit. Look at That's Kylo. Get the weight room, you bum. And the leader of the defense at corner is in the zone right now. Looking. Got a boy, rah rah, bang! Oh my god! I didn't mean to throw that. Whoops, wrong button. I want it. Yep, that's me. You think I got a hundred tight ends in here? Yep. Makes a lot of sense. That's Ram football. If teams knew, do know that you can't stop the run, they just run the ball down our throats, they would definitely probably win football. Which I'm fine with. It's cool. You know, you let you all, know, you could probably win football games against us if you just run the football. Now, Jersey beats Iowa 37 to. A 14 to extend their uh, win streak here to nine. And, you know, are they nine and zero now. This probably feels they should have won this game. Just been dominating. It's what it is. You know, we got to keep keep doing it and just be good. You know, we out here trying to straight win and get four in a row natty titles. That's what we want. We want the natty titles ASAP. No rock. I don't know what to do. All right, so total offense for us was 380. Not bad. Uh, just, I ain't going to lie. Uh, you, the, the stats do speak for themselves. 30, 13 out of 31. Some of these these passes, man, were touchdown worthy. We just couldn't get to the ball or we were dropping them. Castro had three touchdowns with three picks. Uh, Mike Martin, seven uh, touches, 71 yards. Uh, iconic. Five catches, 73 yards with a tutty. Uh, Ra Ra Jackson, five catches, 160 with a tutty. Tied with two. Uh, Ricky Moss with one. Uh, everyone else, but a couple, couple drops, man. Kind of shouldn't have been dropped at all. A uh, Big Red had seven pancakes as long as with IHOP at six. Sacks allowed. Joey Old at two. Yikes. Uh, defense side of the ball. Kyla Banks had four sacks in the game 
Uh, oh, Ellis had <laughs> uh, Jalen Ellis was out, but he had a pick. Was actually just laying the boomstick on people. Um, let's see. Justin Smith had two picks. Uh, Jordan Ellis with a sack. Uh, that's about it, though. Yeah. So I mean, it was a sh it, kind of a, de a good game, but it's just shitty to be honest. But we'll, hopefully, we pick it up next game. And uh, look forward to that. So there you go. South Jersey, number one ranked, undefeated, beat Iowa 37 to 14. Playoff rankings. Oh, shit. We dropped to number two. LSU's now number one. Uh, Penn State, three. Wisconsin at four. And the, uh, North Carolina, Texas Tech at six. U uh, Ohio State at seven. Texas A&M at nine. All right. Sorry, really. We got to look at the polls here. So now... LSU beat UCF, of course. Uh, what was it? Yeah, you, I said UCF. My fault. They beat Florida thirty-one to twenty-four. They beat a ranked team. We we beat Iowa thirty-seven to fourteen, unranked. So obviously, you know, we're not there. For right now, Castro is on his way for three thousand yards. Uh, Michael Martin almost on his road to get. 700 yards receiving wise as well. Ra Ra is almost getting a th almost up to 900 yards. Kenny Problem is our team leader in tackles. Cyrus with 14 and then interceptions. Jerry Brickhouse. But yeah, it looks like it's because you know, also too, they beat Florida that who is ranked. So it is what it is. I ain't really tripping on it. Uh, Isaac Austin now. See what I'm saying? Now this is where. Shit got real because that man threw for six touchdowns or had six total touchdowns compared to Castro, who had four touchdowns. So, you know, it's a little, it's a race. It's truly a race. We have to literally find a way to just get in the end zone with Castro. Is that, you know, hand the ball off with him, scramble in, cutties, but throwing the pick, throwing picks is not one of them. But like I said, total total touchdowns of 38. This man's rocking with 43. So then, now Isaac has 43 touchdowns. Okay, years the year's best. Is this cash show? Hell yeah. South Jersey leader is one of the top or the 12 semifinalists for the 2029 O'Brien Award. So there's Isaac right there. The Isaac's right there. Cash show's right there. The top six. Uh Okay, Kenny with the uh, Chuck Barnett. Uh, oh, wow. Look at three of the, of the Rams are on here. Uh, Kenny Problems, Jerry Brickhouse, and also Justin Smith. All linebackers. Jesus, dude. Uh, cash over for the O'Brien. Uh, Walker, I think it's running back. So, that, we're not looking at that. Uh, Blitnikoff, Ra Ra Jackson's at five right now. Top five. Uh... Ooh, okay, you got the McKee is Johnny Wilson right there. He's top four. Uh, the Outland Award, Big Red and IHopper right behind each other. Remington and Joe Alt again. Uh, for the Lombardi, Cyrus is there. The Junior. Uh, and the Dick Buckus Award, you got you got Kenny Problems and Breckhouse too. Top one and top four. Uh, the the uh, Thorpe Award is Jalen uh, Ellis. He's there for top five. So we have... Um, would you look at that? The Ray Guy Award. Randall Keith Orton is going to get... It might be there. Holy shit. Uh, but yeah, a lot of Rams getting awards, which we would really like to see. We haven't seen that in a very long time. And it's about damn time, to be honest. So, but there it is. Not too shabby. Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler along with my partners, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. We're going to enjoy great weather in tonight's game as the skies are clear and the temperature is just right for the Rams and the Houston Cougars. Well, we hope you're as excited as we are for this one. And here come the Cougars. The Rams are very confident coming into this one. They are definitely the favorites in my book, Kirk. The away team will win this football game because of their quarterback. And the thing I noticed about him is his ability to spread the ball out to a number of different receivers. I think he'll have a solid game, and they're going to win by two touchdowns. I picked my winner this morning. Here we go. I really believe that these guys are going to do it. All right, 88 overall quarterback here, Lincoln Ken Holtz. 
90, 89 speed with 85, or 89 throwing power, 85 accuracy. Jatavian Stevenson, 93 overall running back. Okay. Damn, 94 break tackling. Oh, shit. Uh, JJ, uh, he's out for 10 weeks. Don't have to worry about him. Jordan, 6'3", 82 overall. Just catching. 82. Another Jordan, he's decent. Uh, Dante Tatum, 96 overall. 96 speed. Chase Scott, 6'1". Wow, shitheads out there. Uh, Ofemi Raham, tight end. 6'6". Six, six. Man, the whole 6'6". Six, six, Jeez. 6'6", six, 6'5". Six, six, Not bad. Line looks pretty decent. They got suspension. So there's going to be a center at 88 overall. All right. Uh, this is a right tackle as they're on the freshman team. Desmond Jones. Okay. Uh, looks like a decent line here, too. Pretty good linebackers. Not bad. Jimmy Lankford. 95 speed, 89 overall. Yikes. Uh, Rashad Holmes, 6'1", 85 speed. Jace Franklin, 6'3", with 93 speed. Uh, all of them have both bear, poor awareness, but we should be locked in. Though. Cameron Luke, 6'4". Uh, Jason King, or Jackson King, excuse me. She's 95 overall. I'm a little nervous over here. 78 tackling, 91 awareness with the locking on there. And of course, Armani, Armani Williams, 6 1 impact player. So they got two impact players that are safeties. Yeah, the multiple suspensions. The guys are crazy out here. But yeah, man, hopefully we'd be locked in because these guys are pretty pretty disgusting. Uh, injuries for the J.J. Johnson, 6'5", receiver, is out for 10 weeks with a dislocated elbow, and their D-tackle freshman out with a broken jaw. That dude probably got smacked at the bar and got mink monk. Oh, my Lord. We don't give a damn about your impact player. Rob Rod Jackson is here. Are you, what the? Come on, bro. Nickel defense. Look, he rolls out to the right. Throws this one out to the right. Overthrown. Castro lines up with five wide out. Castro. Come on, Rob, Rob, that boy, go, go. Oh, oh my God. I'm trying. They line up in the shotgun. Castro on first down. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, lines up in the shotgun. Drop back to pass. Looking, rolling out to the left side. He's rolling right. Ah! Oh my god, I tried to be spectacular. Oh my god. I have no clue, man. Scoop! Oh my god. Got a boy, Justin Smith. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. Here comes the special team unit. The kick is up. And Damn, what a boot. He hit that one from Damn. Out there. Castro, back in the gun. Five TDs, copy. Play action. He's looking. Rolls to the right. Wants to go long and... Shakes off a tackle. Oh, my God. Five wide. They'll throw on first down. Damn. Oh my god. Holy shit. That a boy prop. Look at 55. Boy. Oh my lord. And they couldn't hook up on that one. He had his arms in to kick the field goal. He's going to have to get a leg into this one. He gets it up, and it's good. Wow. This drop. They line up in the shotgun. They snap it to the back. Damn. <laughs> Castro lines up in the shotgun. Come on, Castro. Come on, Castro. He spins around. The boy. And they make the stop. They go with from the gun. It's a direct snap. Here's an opening. Face match, please. Thank you. 
What? Oh my god. Look at Castro. <laughs> No way, dude. Come on, Ra Ra. Bang! Let's go! Come on! Let's go! There's 55. There's the kid. Jesus. Number 15, back in the gun. He drops back. Oh! Down the middle. Oh my god. Ball is and this impact linebacker is fired. Daddy! That a boy, Cyrus? He might have grabbed his face, man. Oh, don't give me this shit, man. Unbelievable. If anyone can force a turnover right now, give me that. Oh, yeah. That a boy, let's go! Come on! Talking about man. Come on, Castro. Oh! Look at Albert Castro, baby. Okay, Scoob. What the fuck? I like it. Oh my god, lost in the sauce. He's out of bounds! Are we... 55? Oh my god, he's there, bro. That boy was scared. That dude was absolutely scared. Boy. With a takedown. Castro lines up in the shotgun. Drop it back to pass. Looking. Fires a bullet over the middle. That is ball. My God. Castro back to the gun. They go with the option. Ah, that black linebacker was screaming, dude. They'll throw on first down. Oh, Ellis would have thought that was tough. He ran a good one. And the impact linebacker has turned it up a notch. Oh my god. Choose one out of ten. Us for all time. Get his ass. Damn. Damn, K. Dot. Oh plays for the defense. Not only do you not Jesus, stop him on dude. Third down, you give up big gainer on the ground. Uh oh, oh boy, nice option play there. That a boy. They'll bring him down. That a boy. Let's go to halftime. Orange slices. So Castro's on his way trying to get a Heisman Kennedy. There's 55. Finally. Finally. They get to the quarterback and the Cougs set up in the gun. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. It looks like he's. I should have realized my wrestling instincts. That a boy finally 55. He's a fake wrestling fan. <laughs> yeah, all right, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at Castro throwing some blocks. <gasps> Holy shit, that boy got rocked. The offense put the ball on the ground, but give the defense. Holy the shit, the Castro. Damn. <laughs> dude, he got a molly bop, dude. Damn. Boy, come on, 50, like, not 55, excuse me, k Dot needs, he laying the lumber on these dudes, and yet they're not fumbling, bro. This man is benting face masks, through, he's ruining shoulder pads, and yet, no fumble, bro. Oh, boy. 
Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He throws it. Oh! oh give me that. Rex Brown. Pick six. Could it be? He's off to the crib. The 20. The 10. The 5. Rex Brown pick six. Come on. Is the game close now? 55. Look at that. Holy shit. <laughs> Rex Brown. But uh, this will be the last season, so if you want to, you know, try to chill and wait, we're going to be dropping. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm on 55. Let's go! And you can become a... Uh, be on for college football 25, so you don't have to worry about that too much right now. But 55 with the pick. We'll get ready for uh, 25. I'm going. Give me block. That boy Castro. 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 Oh my God, he stinks. I am trying to give you Heisman stuff, and you are ruining it right now, my guy. Your second fumble of the game. If you don't lock in. Oh shit. And we probably didn't really might bump up the score anyway, too, so that probably doesn't hurt. Give me that. Oh! Oh, my God. 55, thank you. How do you have the gap wide open? That a boy! Oh my god, that's crazy shit right there. <laughs> Got a boy, come on. Oh my lord! Damn! Jesus, go ahead. Get him. And this hit back receiver is looking to make a play. He's in the zone. Rolls right. He wants it all. Goes Thank you. He's Thank you, Ra Ra. To the 35 yard line. Three wideouts to the right side. Castro sets up the play action. Hi. Oh my god. That's yeah, disgusting. That guessing now or what? <laughs> I mean, did you see how well he hit the ball? Yeah, some quarterbacks are just so good at selling the play action. Ew. Truly an overlooked skill. Ew. Take my friend Kirk here for a second. <laughs> He drops back. Throws it to the outside. Oh, come on. Got it to him on the run. Is that a bound? There's the ball. I got one. Third and one. My ass hair. Houston comes to the line with three wide. That a boy. What are they going to do? Is this fourth down? Yep. They're going for it. They're they dropping nuts. They're dropping some nuts. Uh oh. Come on. They still get it. They convert it. Damn. Oh, got to pick that. Come on. Oh, my Lord. Guys are locked in right now, man. Oh, my Lord. Oh, we dropped it. <laughs> Holy shit. That a boy. Come on. That a boy, Ellis. That a boy, Kylo. Let's go. Ball game, baby. Alright, well there you have it. The Rams beat the Cougars to make it 10 and 0. Man, 28 to 14. It was a good game though. I'm not gonna lie. They, it was Castro fumbled twice. Or, you know, we're, he's he's feels like he's trying to you know do too much, and then which leads to throwing the pick, you know, throwing the, the ball twice, intercept it, fumbling the ball twice. It's been a rough game for him, but he came back clutch. That bomb to tie. But damn, man. It just wasn't. It was a good game, but it just wasn't it. Um.
Let's take a look at here. Cash, like I said, 5 out of 11, 157 yards. One of probably his worst games. Um, two touchdowns, two picks, and then not getting sacked twice, but probably one of his worst games of the season. Rushing the ball, Castro, like you said, he was trying to do something on, the, on his legs as well. 11 attempts, 69 yards. <laughs> nice. Uh, with a, one touchdown. Receiving, Ra Ra Jackson, four catches, 122 yards and a touchdown. Ty Bryson with one catch with a, one, one touchdown. Pancakes, IHOP, uh, who wants some chocolate syrup on their pancakes? He gets seven. Defensive. Stats right here. Justin Smith, 10 tackles. Absolute dog. Uh, with, next to him was Kenny Problems with seven, with two sacks and a pick. Now we're talking. Now we're getting back to the old old uh, 55 right here. K-Dot with four tackles. Jalen Ellis with four tackles. Kylo Banks with two sacks of the game. Uh, who else here? Rex Brown with a pick six to the crib. Uh, Jordan Ellis with a sack. Uh, anyone else? Yeah, Cyrus with a sack. And then Jerry Brickhouse with a pick. Um... Yeah, it looks like he kind of gave up the Heisman. I mean, if we can finally wait, I don't know. I mean, we have to, <laughs> I just don't know. Um, but we just got to find a way. We really do. But there you have it. SJU beats Houston 28-14. to I never talked to them boys that sat on them benches, man. I was in the game on fourth and inches. Coach, put me in the game on fourth and inches. And I'm going to leave them boys at the line of scrimmage. Yeah, I see them boys all behind me. I ain't Mario Williams, but I'm not defenseless. 